Good morning everyone! Welcome back to my channel. So today we're going to do things a little bit different. Today I'm going to do a vlog, which if you're not familiar is kind of like um, a take you along with me and show you what my day is like. So today is going to be, I hope, <laughs> a productive day. Uh, the first thing we're going to do is clean some rabbit cages. So I'm a rabbit breeder, I have pet Holland Lops, and their cages are constantly in need of cleaning. So I've got a bunch of litter boxes to clean and I'm going to let the rabbits run around while I do that. some grocery shopping to do. I'm going to head to Freshco, which is a chain in Canada here, and I'm going to pick up some groceries if you want to come along with me. back home again and Levi's having some lunch over here. Got some carrots, green beans, mashed potatoes, and applesauce. Is it delicious? Yeah. Sounded like you said yeah. Do you want a bite? So this is what we got from the grocery store. Cereal was on sale, so we got Honey Nut Cheerios and Multigrain Cheerios. Cookies. Uh, I got three packages of cookies, which I normally don't do. Um, tell me, does anyone else have this problem? You buy multiple packs of cookies and your husband eats them all? No? Just me? Okay. Uh, so I actually hide some. Um, I have a lot of different hiding spots. And I tell my husband that if he finds them, that I will just up my game. So yeah, three boxes of cookies, a loaf of bread, chicken, I'm going to make stir fry with that, beef, I'm going to make pasta with that, um, these here are for Levi, just little squeeze, um, applesauce and veggies, I don't feed them a lot, but they're good for backup, and I've got some pasta sauce, and some cream up soups. I can link the video in the cards above for that, um, what dishes I make with this cream of pasta um, dishes that I make. And then I've got some chicken broth, some iced tea, and some pierogies. These ones are dill ones. I haven't tried those before, so that should be good. And we've got some healthier options. Uh, we did not buy that. <laughs> uh, I guess the chips are not healthy, but... Chips, I've already got salsa to go with those. Plain yogurt uh, to go with the homemade granola that I make. I will link that above so you can see how to make that as well. Uh, rice, that will go with our stir fry. Pasta. Oats, that's ingredients for in the granola. Applesauce for the little guy. Avocado for the little guy. Tomatoes. Cucumber. Um, and then mixed greens, those will go for a salad. Broccoli, I'm going to make something with that. Pears, bananas, the zucchini, and pepper, those will go in the pasta. 
And then this here is sort of like a stir fry veggies, and that's going to go in the stir fry with the chicken tonight. And blueberries, that's also for the little guy. And that's everything there. So that's about $80 Canadian. Look at this pile of dishes. Like, you would think that I didn't do dishes for like a week. I did dishes yesterday. I just didn't do them last night or this morning. So now I have to tackle those. I mean, I did, you know, do some baking and stuff, but really, like, I hate doing dishes. Does anyone else hate doing dishes? Like, it has to be my least favorite thing to do out of all household chores. I guess the best way to get them done is to actually do the dishes. They don't really, like, I find when I leave them there for a long time and I come back, they just, they don't seem to do themselves. I don't know. Just, anyone else have that problem? I like to do the easy items first because then I feel like, oh, okay, I've already got those done. But then when I get to the hard items, I like to let them soak, you know? And then, like, I, I don't do them right away, so I, like, soak them and I come back in an hour and then I'm like, oh, I should probably do this. So maybe if you guys are watching, I'll be more inclined to speed up the process and just get the dishes done. what this little guy is doing while I'm doing dishes. Well, as you can see, I'm not actually currently doing dishes. I'm procrastinating a little. They're soaking, you know? All right, the pile of dishes is getting smaller. They're not done yet, but here's the progress. My big pile. Okay, so no procrastination. Just get it done. Look at this. Clean counter, no more dishes, clean sink. Okay, I do have to put away those after they dry. But that's okay, I don't mind putting away dishes, it's the cleaning of them that I do not like. I've been putting off for quite a while is cleaning out my microwave. So I'm going to do that today. So... I don't know why I'm showing you this because it's bad, but this is real life here. I've already taken out the uh, glass tray that goes around, so I'm going to give this a good clean. And there we go. A clean microwave. What a good feeling. been feeling very motivated because I even washed my drying rack and the tray that goes underneath it and the one for the cutlery. So we're just headed out to do a couple of outside chores. So this is how we collect corn. This little guy sitting in the front and behind him is a feed bag filled with corn. He doesn't come with me every time I get corn. Sometimes it's too cold. But today it's pretty mild. Here's the ducks over here. They're terrified because of 
<laughs> this little guy. <laughs> Shall we feed them some corn? All right. Well guys, I hope you enjoyed a clean and grocery shop kind of a day. Let me know in the comments below if you like these style of videos and I will do more of these. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and I will see you guys next time. Bye!